It's the details of Mark's will. What's it say? He wants us to hold a proper formal reading, and he sent a list of the people to attend. But he wants it read out? That's what it says here, and... Apparently, I'm to be his executor. Who's on the list? He wants it to be held here. I'll gather people around for this afternoon. What's in the package? Uh, not to be opened yet. Well, I hope everybody can make it with it being such short notice. Wouldn't it be best if we left it till after the weekend? Once we've done this, it'll be the last thing. But that's just it. I don't want it to be the last thing. We only just buried him yesterday, and it just seems to me as though we're trying to get everything to do with him out of the way quickly. Wouldn't Mark want us to get on with things? I just feel it's too soon, that's all. All right, mine. How are you feeling? Yeah, not bad. It was, uh, it was a good send-off yesterday. Yeah, good turnout. Yeah, um, look, could you come round ours at three o'clock today? And what for? Well, we're reading Mark's will. Well, so why have I got to be there? Because you're on the list. What list? People that Mark wants to be there. I can hold a fool. Right, so you'll be there, yeah? Yeah, yeah, of course I will, yeah. Right, well, I'll see you then. Yeah, see you, mate. I'm, uh, sorry I'm late. Gary? I didn't really think about getting changed or anything. That's OK. Yeah, Paul, come sit down. Yeah, yeah. come sit down, mate. Thanks, Vicky. Thank All right. Right, everybody's here, so let's get started. Mark has asked me to act as executor for his will. But I'm as much in the dark as you all as regards what's in it. So, the last will and testament of Mark Fowler. It says that I'm to read it as it is written. This is my will, and if anyone gets too morbid, then Derek is to put on his Oklahoma CD until they beg for mercy. <laughs> <laughs> and what is wrong with Oklahoma? <laughs> <laughs> each of these AIDS charities will get the same amount. Martin and Vicky are each to receive £5,000, which is to be put in trust for them until they're 21. I know you might think this is a downer, but trust me, you'll thank me one day. Maybe. He knows me too well. And before anyone worries, yes, I did blow some of the profits from the house on enjoying this last year and didn't just save it all for you lot. <laughs> Ian, like Martin and Vicky, I've left you £5,000. Five grand? You've always worked hard. I know you will succeed. And when you own most of Alford, just remember who gave you this money and name a shopping centre after me. I wasn't expecting anything. You are right, Mum? Yeah, it was... It's like he was here with us. What is it? Well, it says here... I'm sorry it's a bit scratch, Sharon, but did you really think I didn't know you and Shell played my albums when I was out? <laughs> Listen to this and know that I appreciate what a good mate you've been. Enjoy. It's that your one? Mm. Oh. I remember his grand giving some money towards that for one of his birthdays. Mm. And he's left me a book. Oh, which one? Complete works of Shakespeare. <gasps> oh, I remember that. He had that when he was at school. Oh, Mark Fowler, 4A. <laughs> for Derek. I know I should have read at least one of these plays, but I never did. Read them for me now, Mark. Gary, these are for you. All I'm to say is, treat her better than the women in your life. Oh, don't. It's the keys to his bike. He left me his bike? Yeah. Not just the keys. <laughs> <laughs> Pauline, this is your bit. Would you like to read it? No, no. You go ahead. My mum is to get what's left which should be about 5,000 or so after everything is sorted. And everyone here is witness to this, that it's not to be spent on anyone but yourself. Go mad, Mum, and enjoy it. That rainy day is a long way off and might never come. 
But, Mum, for me to face all this now, I need to know that you can keep going and enjoy life. You've got plenty of wonderful people around. Martin and Shell need you more than me now, but I'm still going to be there with you, Mum. I'm not in any grave or even under the ground. I'm everywhere you go. And I'm everything you see. And I will always love you. And I love you, son. I think Sonia was wondering if you fancy going for a drink. Um, no, I don't think I will, but you go, though. Oh, we'd stay in if you'd rather. Now, you know what Mark said? We're not to stop doing things. Then a swift half won't do us any harm, will it? No, all right, then. Mm. Start spending the money left you on the first round. Now, you know what your brother said? That money was for me. Yeah. Well, come on, then. Let's get going. Thank you. Oh, I'm so glad I've got you. I'm going to be all right. 